Merkel Media. He put it in park, threw open the driver's door, ran out the side of the car, across the front of it, and jumped right off the side of the bridge in front of me. The only people who really pulled over were truckers. He said, we're going to Hodge, and he didn't slow down. He went across the median onto the oncoming traffic, but where they could see him coming, they just got out of the way. I noticed this plane was really low. He went right in front of us, hit the fence, and it spun around. You know, 30 seconds more, he could have hit us. And I went around that truck and a guy stepped out from behind the truck and threw a piece of wood and shot through my window just like a spear and stuck in the back of the cab of my truck. That's probably one of the stranger things I've Welcome seen. to Hammer Lane Legends. I'm Brian Merkel. I'm Brian Shimmer. I'm Mike Dre. He almost forgot who he was. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Hammer Lane Legends. If you have a crazy and wild story you would like to share with us from the road, Go ahead and contact us at hllpodcast at protonmail.com. That's hllpodcast at protonmail.com. Or go to the hammerlanelegends.com webpage, which we don't even go to. Right. Hit the contact section. <laughs> you can get hold of us that way. It does go through the Proton Mail, so we do get your emails. I want anybody thinking that we're not looking. I'm always looking. I'm just not, you know, I'm not hearing a lot from people. <laughs> well, you said you had three voicemails. Did you ever get them? I totally forgot about them. Thank you for reminding me. That's why we got to... Yep, that's why. (laughs) Anyway, (laughs) hit the contact section, get a hold of us that way. Either way it works for us, just get a hold of us. Chipper, tell them about Buy Me a Coffee. Buy Me a Coffee. Keep me fueled. Into your microphone, yeah. That's how it works. (laughs) Buy Me a Coffee. If you like what we're doing here, you can contribute. Buy Me a Coffee at buymeacoffee.com. Yeah. buymeacoffee.com forward slash hammer lane yeah that's it that's well, the one right all there. right if you feel if you feel like contributing uh you thank know, you very keep much your support of our show we appreciate it we have certainly a good day do moving along moving right along moving right along it's magic it is really magic happens. it's where the magic happens <laughs> this is like it's like disneyland right it's like the magic kingdom <laughs> castle thing yeah not really Amazing. but pose the ride off <laughs> fire it back up again <laughs> Well, Shipper, nobody, nobody dies here. Shipper, nope, who, they, they die off property in the ambulance. That's, the way it, to that's it. Nobody dies in Disney World. This is not Epcot Center. Yes. Well, no. We're talking We're, Disney World. Is that all part thing. of Disney World? Disney Epcot, Epcot is part of Disney World. Yeah, right? It's a yeah. different part. Disneyland, or yeah, Disney World is in Florida. Yeah, Disneyland's right. in California. But yeah, people but do Epcot, not die. Epcot, yes, is, is part of Disney. Yes. I appreciate that. Oh, what the fuck? Just trying to make sure I was, you know, <laughs> in the right area. I've been to Disney World and Disneyland multiple times. So. I've never been. Where do you go? Well, as a, kid, I mean, I, as a kid, and then I took my kids to Disney World. But As a kid, I did watch The Wonderful World of Disney. Oh. Are we going to start a Sunday on that night? night? Yeah. <laughs> you know, but I've never been. Going down the cheese line? <laughs> <laughs> That's where my wife and I honeymoon was in Disney World in Florida. And since then, how's it been? It's been an amusement park. Well, the, Mar- <laughs> yeah, the amusement park's going great. Marriage is doing very well. Too. There, that, there you go. That was like 20, oh boy, hold on. 25 years ago. Oh, 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 we almost forgot. I did. That's not good. I don't think Chris, did she listen? Yeah, she watches on YouTube. But it's okay, because when I ask her how long we've been married, she has to sit there and... She has to think, too. Huh? She does the math yeah. with the abacus. <laughs> so... <laughs> she moves the beads. <laughs> Carry the one... <laughs> Too long. Well, at least you can do math. You know, not nowadays. <laughs> <laughs> she has penmanship. So right. well, we'll give her that. that. <laughs> anyway, Shepard, who are we talking to today? Who do we got in studio? We, we got have, a guest We have Erin doing the... She is back. Halloween version of, of our show. That's right. This is the Halloween version. The scary of our show. one. We've never done one before. So this you're is it. like all new for us. And just, you're it. Tag, you're it. <laughs> so. Hey, I feel special. <laughs> You are special. You're our first <laughs> Halloween person. Well, hopefully I can deliver a good show. I think you will. I think you're gonna do I think you're gonna deliver a fantastic show. The thing is the problem is, is I put, actually put a message out on our on our fan page that I'm blocked from actually re- commenting. <laughs> I heard on. about that. <laughs> yeah. That's hilarious. I was so mad. <laughs> so I said to Michelle, can you make a post for like, you know, to get some, you know, maybe maybe somebody's got a, a, a scary story for Halloween because it's like October. 
So she put one out. Have I heard from anybody? Absolutely not. <laughs> so you're it. <laughs> so I, I got some stories. You do, and we we're uh, looking forward to hearing them. As as he was panicking, I said, "Let me see if I could pull a rabbit out of my ass." And ta da! <laughs> I just get a disturbing mental image in my head. That is. Yeah. <laughs> well, I have the text you right said, here. You could have just said hat. <laughs> that poor rabbit. Yeah, I was just thinking the same thing. That poor little bunny. <laughs> he had to go through. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> So. Well, I did my job. Good day to you, sir. <laughs> and you did fine. Thank right. you so much, sir. It, it, I'm glad you did. They feel special now. I don't. But. Anyway, let's go. Go ahead. Interviewer. What happened? <laughs> what? what happened? <laughs> back, <laughs> from, back at the last show, you alluded to the house you moved into was haunted. Meanwhile, back at the ranch. Right. Yeah. Yeah, no. So. And as Donald Trump says, as you were saying, <laughs> <laughs> nobody's going to shoot you. I promise. <laughs> right. Not. <laughs> we're not that important. So. Yeah. No. Me either. But anyway, I got, I got yeah, you what, covered. What did happen? What What, yeah, well, what is the story? So I, I'm interested. I'm me, intrigued. Me and my ex husband um, bought this house. We mm-hmm. were all excited for it, and the I went in to do like the house inspection, like the guy that comes in. And one of the neighbors came out. I was just standing there waiting for him to finish. And one of the neighbors comes out and he's like, hey, do you know what happened in this house? And I was like, well, no, I don't. (laughs) No, but I'm intrigued now. I was going to bring this up on the full disclosure of buying a house. Ah. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, Yeah. Yeah. So I was like, well, no. And he's like, well, the husband murdered his wife. And I was like. Oh, oh, wow. Well, that's why we got a hell of a deal. That, <laughs> <laughs> no, no. That's why all the rooms are freshly painted. Yeah. <laughs> yes. and condition. Yeah. New carpet. Yeah. <laughs> Newly painted, new flooring. No, well, we did get it for a good deal. Not because of that, but because <laughs> the previous owner, not the murder guy, but somebody else had owned it before <laughs> us and that had went into foreclosure. So oh, okay. <laughs> we did get well, it. Well, that'll do it too. <laughs> Foreclosure, or they heard the words "get out." Yeah, <laughs> it could be. It could be. <laughs> yeah. So he's telling me about it, and he and I was like, "Well, no." And he's like, "Well, yeah, he murdered his wife. Like it was a big thing." And so I left, and I was like, "That was fu- that was nuts." Right. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> good, tech, good save. Mor- Mor- Mormon manners. <laughs> Mormon manners. I remember them. They do, they are there. Is that the hotel that Shipper stays at? Mormon Manor? <laughs> yeah, when I break down. <laughs> but so I went and I called my best friend and I was like, yo, I was like, you won't believe like what this guy just told me. Right. So she starts Googling it and she's like, there's a forensic files episode about it. <laughs> so, wow. <laughs> so I was like, oh, shit, I watched it. And I was like, yeah, that that's that's my house. <laughs> that's my new yeah, house. That's, <laughs> that's where I'm going to be living. I hope. But yeah, so it, what it came down to is he, you know, he murdered his wife. He uh-huh. set up a whole thing about she was like cheating on him, but, and he was writing he was writing these letters from a stalker to her. Wow, that sounds creepy. And so he, she was like, thinking it would scare her back to him. Uh huh. And when it didn't work, he murdered her. Did, but was she really cheating on him? No. 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 Okay. That's, he, that's, he set up the backstory. He just set yeah. it all up so it looked that yeah, way. Yeah. And so then when the police started looking into him, they were, what wow. he did was he strangled her to death with oh. a dog leash in our sunroom. Oh. <clears throat> it, it, it adds a whole new dimension when you say he strangled her to death. In our sunroom. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, no, no. Well, it the was. Dog, the dog yeah. Yeah. She's but you know what I mean? Like, it just ma- it, that takes it to that, that oh, level yeah. of it's like, this is really Did weird. Did anybody look it's at creepy. the dog, though? It was it a dog leash. It was a dog leash. <laughs> dog had nothing to do with it. Yeah. <laughs> there was no dogs harmed in this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just humans. <laughs> so, um, he, and I guess he dragged her out and put her in the back of her car. Wow. Um. Drove her to the grocery store like a mile down the road. He went in and bought <laughs> at six o'clock in the morning. He went in, bought dog treats, and then walked home. So they have evidence of him pulling in, 
walking in to buy dog treats at six yeah. o'clock in the morning and then walking a mile home. What? He had to make it up to Fido for using his leash. I guess so. <laughs> So what they, what ultimately happened is, you know, they caught him and they did all these forensics on proving that it was him. He right. he was writing the police like, hey, I'm the guy that killed her. Like, da, 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 trying was to like throw Jack the Ripper. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, you've got the wrong guy. Like all this kind of stuff. Right. <laughs> trying to throw the police off. Like it, 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 it's the story. Wow. So anyways, like after we moved in, mm-hmm. it's like maybe a month or two after we first moved in that I started hearing things. And I'm generally up late anyways. That's why uh-huh. I like working the shift I do. Because <laughs> those are like my general awake hours. And I would be watching TV at 2 o'clock in the morning. Kids are all asleep. My husband was asleep. Everybody's out. And all of a sudden I just hear screaming, like a lady screaming. Wow. So I pause the TV because, you know, sometimes it could just mm-hmm. be like background noise on the TV or whatever. So I pause yeah. it and I'm like listening and I still hear it. And I was like, is that outside? Like, what is happening? So I'm like, look outside. I open the door. I'm like looking around. I don't hear anything. Uh-huh. So I shut the door again and I still hear it. And I was like, no. I was like, all right. So I just turned my show back on and I was like, I'm going to ignore this the best I can. Right. And I did. It, it stopped. And then it was like, I don't know, maybe a couple of weeks later, um, my girls, when they were babies, had these toys that mm-hmm. was like a caterpillar. And you had to like pull it or twist it to make it make noise. Okay. Like if it was just sitting there not being touched, it wasn't doing anything. <clears throat> and all of a sudden, it would make noises like these like, beep, 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 like stupid noises. Mm-hmm. And that was going off in the middle of the night. Wow. Like out of the blue, nobody's around. Blue, it and everybody's just... in bed, everybody's sleeping, this toy's going off. So the one day I threw it out into the front yard. Because <laughs> I was like, I'm not dealing with this. <laughs> like, get out of my house. <laughs> yep. And I went to bed and I woke up the next morning. It was back in my living room. Wow. So kids what? Were, the kids were not awake yet. They hadn't been outside. It was back in my living room. That's freaky, dude. That's like, all right, we're going to a hotel. Yeah, I was. And I kept telling my ex, I was like, we need to like get this place like looked at. Like I want some paranormal people to come in. And he is not a believer in any of this. So er anytime I told him about like what I would hear or Uh things that would happen. Nah, you're telling your head. You're full of shit. Like, da, da, da. So I just quit telling him everything that would happen. So he so, wasn't hearing anything. No, I mean, he they, wasn't there was hearing nothing it. that he, was happening when yeah, he was around. Yeah. And I was just like, well, I'm just going to stop telling you then because you just, you know, are just like making me feel dumb. Right. <clears throat> so, but yeah, that ended up back in the living room. Um, that right there. I mean, that, <laughs> if that were me, I'd be like, we're out. Yeah, what? we're gone. That toy got thrown into the trash and and burned. And and it, I watched it go with the trash guys. Like <laughs> it comes back now. We're out. <laughs> yeah, right, out right, 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 yeah. yeah. That's like polar guys get yeah. out. <laughs> like, it, was, it was scary. And then I don't know, like a few months after we had moved in, it was in 2011 in Pennsylvania. Got like this really big like storm from like some hurricane i don't know mm-hmm. but we got like there we had a ton of flooding in pennsylvania that year and my basement had flooded <laughs> like i had my kids were silent and, and you know when you got toddlers that are quiet it's not good nope and so i was like what are they up to and i hear them all of a sudden like giggling and downstairs and i hear kind of water splashing Oh. And I went down the basement and I had like six inches of water in my whole basement. Nice. <laughs> so they were just swimming. They're like, look, we're ducks. <laughs> 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 they did. That's what they said to me. Look, we're ducks. <laughs> and I was like, oh, crap. So after that, um, it had also uprooted, like the storm had uprooted one of our apple trees that was in the backyard. She had planted, wow. this lady had planted two apple trees. And um, one of them had gotten uprooted, so we just tore it out. And evidently, she loved these trees. Like, 
the neighbor was like, those were her favorite trees. I can't believe you would just rip it out. Like he gave me a hard time for like ripping this tree out. And I'm like, wow. it was half on the ground. The roots are coming out. Like we can't like, save it. Like, can I stop you for a second? Yeah. <clears throat> now I'm going to revert back to the other show. Did this woman have an English accent? Because I'm just saying about your oldest daughter needing an apple to make her feel better. Oh, no, she, <laughs> she had a, no, my youngest had an English accent way before we moved in. Oh, okay. yeah. All right. All right. Just, just checking because I'm hearing apple tree. I'm thinking, hmm, this could be weird. No, no. She did used to say that, though. Like that. You know, because we're like wondering how she got the accent. I'm thinking. Right. <laughs> Okay, you know, go ahead. I apologize. For watching Peppa Pig or something. No, I never let them watch those. They watched Mickey Mouse. Uh-huh. I would ne- like. I didn't even let them watch like Caillou, like anything that annoyed the shit out of me. I, they did not watch. <laughs> but it's just about every cartoon nowadays. Yeah. Like there was very like we watched the backyard again. No Teletubbies. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Oh, no. no. <laughs> we did no Teletubbies. No Barney. No SpongeBob. None of that. I heard that. None of it. They didn't. And actually, I did watch Blue's, Blue's Clues with Jackson when he was a kid. Yeah, we did well, not do Blue's Clues. I was in a hotel and he would watch Blue's Clues and we'd watch and then we'd talk. That was our little connection when he was like five or yeah. whatever it was. But anyway. Blue's Clues was not in ours. It was it was a very small list of shows they got to watch. <laughs> <laughs> I don't blame you. I've watched some of those shows. <laughs> nah. But no, that's not where she got it from. Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Well, What's your neighbor from. thinking, telling you what you can't cut right. down a tree? Well, did, did he buy the house? No, no yeah. you so did. So he was like, well, that was her favorite tree. So what? Blah, blah, blah. And I was like, there was no saving it. Right. It's already laying down. So, like, every year, though, I don't know. This could just be something coincidence or stupid. But every year where that tree was, huh? there would always be, like, a bunch of apples. Just one time a year, I'd go out and there'd be like four or five apples just in but that one But the tree wasn't spot. there anymore. But the tree wasn't there. It just That's in that one freaky. spot. There wasn't, the other apple tree was only, it was like five feet away. So uh-huh. I don't know. Yeah. Like that to me though was weird. That is weird. So I don't know if that I agree with you. was like a connection, but to me it is. Yeah, I'm going with that for 500. I'm not the believer in, in any of the paranormal stuff, but as some of this happened to me. I had, I don't know, man. I got bought a brand new house, new construction. And there, I don't have any. Maybe a, maybe a carpenter got a splinter or something oh, in my house. What if That's it was the worst. Built on like an old Indian. I was just thinking yeah, that yeah, very yeah, thing. Yeah, your oh, TV yeah, got not put yeah. that crap into my head. Now I'll be laying in bed tonight. Mm-hmm. Poltergeist happened. Yeah, tonight. yeah. <laughs> But yeah, so that was a weird thing. That is a weird thing. I agree. Um, and maybe this was a sign too. Who knows? My our, mine and my ex's wedding picture kept falling off the wall, like just, oops, just off, randomly yeah. just wind up on the floor. Yeah. And so I took it off the wall, and I had a shelf under where the picture was hanging, and so I just set it on the shelf and had it leaning like up against the wall, uh-huh. and it still kept falling. Wow. Mm-hmm. And I was like, oh. now I think about it, I'm like, maybe that was a sign. Yeah, that is a, that, that is a sign. It's a for sale Couple sign. Couple signs. <laughs> That's a for sale sign. But for at that time, I was like, this lady's got to be knocking this freaking like right. picture off. Like, what? Like, what is happening? <laughs> it was just all these things. And my daughter, my middle daughter, told me, she was like, Mom, I was in there in the sunroom the one day getting a drink out of the uh-huh. fridge because there was a fridge in our sunroom that had like beers and sodas and, you know, drinks. Right. So she's like, I went in to get a drink and we had like a colander, a strainer on top of the fridge. It was a big one that I would use for like canning. Uh And it it flew across the room, like flew across the room. She's like, mom. (laughs) 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 And she's like, it's just, I don't know what. And I was like, I I don't like you. I don't know how you without like wah, like right. that a thing couple apples i can deal with flying across the room and nope. that's it for He's me my down. <laughs> that's where i call it quits there no. yeah no it there was just like that kind of just happened all the time that is really crazy yeah it it, is, it was freaky yeah that is freaky yeah i i, I don't do and you had the three daughters at that time mm-hmm. yeah <laughs> Fuck no, man. I'm out. Are you still, are you still living in that house? No. No. <laughs> no. My ex still lives in that house. God bless him. <laughs> no. God, no. Nope. No. Nope, That's a for it. sale sign out front. That's what that is. Well, him and, him and his new wife can keep it. So nope. have at it. Yep. All right. 
knocking their wedding picture off the wall. I was going to say, does, <laughs> when your your daughters have visitation, go over to his place. Well, we share they, 50-50. Yeah. Do they? Oh, yeah. Ex- they, my middle they daughter. experience of yeah. this stuff now? Yeah. My wow. middle daughter still says, like, she'll hear things. And, yeah. Like, nobody believes her but me because I'm. Because you did. You, I've you experienced, experienced it. it. Yeah. And you, you're wow. right. So he never experienced any of that. He stuff. never like he's like, I'll believe it when I see it. And like I would point things out, like you see, like you. And he's oh, like, no, you know what? Uh, it, 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 it makes you wonder. This just you know, me spitballing. Mm-hmm. Like because you're a woman, and he killed his wife, she was letting you know. Watch out for your old man. He might, That's, you know. Knock his picture off the Listen, thing, you know. Just, just he's not good. Now, now that <laughs> I'm like out of that marriage, uh-huh. I do think that. See, she was not that he he was no. never like abusive. No, I, like I, I don't that. mean to infer that, but he, you know, maybe she thought, you know, yeah. as a as a ghost. I don't know if ghosts think. I guess they I do. I think they do. I would imagine. I think know. they do. We need to dial HQ. <laughs> Get Tony on get, the line. Get Tony on the blower. <laughs> like I really, I wanted to take, I wanted to contact like paranormal like yeah. activity or something, right? And like do like a whole thing, but he would never let me. I don't want any of that in the house. Uh, you're just bad luck. And I'm like, well, if you don't believe in any of it, why, why does it matter? No, right. What's the point? Right. So what? Yeah. Let me well, do it. They'll come for free. That's money we don't need to be spending. I'm like. They'll do it for free. They do it for free. That's They'll just I record it all. Yeah. Right. I'm like, all we got to do like, is leave the house for a night and yeah. let them have it's it. It's their YouTube channel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, dude. But yeah, I always wanted to have that done. And even his aunt was always like, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. When like every, he'd get deployed, he had a job where he was deployed, Yeah. you know, all the time. And so his aunt's like, oh, when he's gone, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm with your aunt. <laughs> well, no, his aunt was like that. Oh, yeah, yeah. his aunt. But, yeah, I, I just, I never did it because I didn't want to, like, make him mad. Yeah, I get that, too. <laughs> so, I can appreciate that. But, but that's crazy. Yeah, it was the craziest thing. And, like, when you watch the Forensic Files, like, mm-hmm. episode, yeah. like, the things that they went to to prove it was him is, like, amazing to me. Like one of the, yeah, I, I literally watched it on the way in. <laughs> one of the while I'm driving Shana, out seventy eight, more show prep. Yeah, Shana <laughs> helped solve it. Yeah, he became a he was a lawyer. He became a lawyer after Shana Na. Which guy? I forget. remember which. One I mean, if I pull, I, I was just curious. I'll, 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 pull, I'll pull up the That's name awesome. after. I know Bowser from Shana. Yeah, no, 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 <laughs> it wasn't Bowser. <laughs> but this guy, um, it's your story. Go Wait, ahead. No, no. <laughs> so th- this guy yeah. after. From he explained, you know, after reading all the contracts that he had to sign oh. for like his music yeah. and stuff, that he became like this lawyer or or something like that, and then like a came, lawyer of linguistics. Yeah, that so he could he could read like different t- styles of like handwriting and oh, like okay. di- right. like what like certain swoops meant on like people's like right like handwriting, a handwriting and like well, right. well yeah, not, yeah, not yeah. only that. Sorry, not a, <laughs> I just watched it. I'm sorry. I can just watch it. Gets so excited. Yeah, I was excited. I've but. been waiting for this. You don't even know. Oh, you don't even know. Anyway, <laughs> so shut up. <laughs> you don't know. But he was, you know, just how the words, just how the words were written out as far as like, His he hasn't letters. had His any context letters. and, or she's not here, you know, right. d- the differentiation between the adjectives and and the uh, pronouns and the this apostrophes. How he like this put is, them together? You know, saying the way you formulated the, you, the way you formulate yeah, the sentence could mean two different things. Gotcha. Basically, is what he said. Yeah, and he, he's good at it. Yeah, he's be, good at it because apparently. of that. That was one of the reasons that they were able to be like, "Hey, this that's guy was the guy that's writing your soccer letters." Yeah. yeah. Like that's figuring crazy. out a tone in written. I know, right? right? Yeah. 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 And, and, and with the other, I'm sorry. <laughs> Go ahead. Fine. But I found that crazy. I was like, well, that's kind of cool because you don't, yeah. you, you hear these singers and you don't, when, once they're done right. doing their, like, yeah. what do they do? Right. This guy went to do something freaking cool. That is really cool. Yeah. I agree. I had no idea. Yeah. And so I like that to me was interesting. Yeah. He also, this was not in the show, but this was, Brought to my attention by the neighbor uh-huh. that was telling me about it. 
He also tried to blame the murder on his son. Son. Wow, what a great dad. Right. Father of the year. <laughs> right. But, All right. Oops. But when that I'm didn't sorry. work out, <laughs> when that didn't work out, he tried to blame the murder on the neighbor that was telling me about the story. Wow. Yeah. Because the problem was with the son, the mother had a great a relationship great relationship between the with son all of her kids. and and I think it was a daughter. It was she had uh, um like two, were they, two boys and a daughter, I believe. Right. They were they and adults by this time? The kids the oldest, they were, they the oldest was an adult. The and oldest was like this. 17, 18, yeah, something he, like he that. Yeah, he was 18, something like that. And the younger ones, I I don't know how old they were, like maybe 10, 12, something. I mean, that just, I, in my own head, <laughs> just in, in all, I, I mean, I, I like watching those forensic shows. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, usually if it's a kid doing it, it ain't that clean. They're not. Yeah, they're, they're not, not strangling mom. They're, yeah, it's a it's a knife. You know, it, it's, it's something a, brutal. Brutal. Yes. It's, you know, especially if a seventeen year old boy yes. testosterone <laughs> takes over and he's like, you know, he's he's going yeah. to town. I mean, I've watched some of Menendez brothers. I've, I've watched, yeah, yeah. You've seen all those oh, shows. Yeah, and they're know? getting they're and on like, re, they're getting retried now. Right, and they're also on TV. So, <laughs> but just you know, they can throw to YouTube like, as a parent to do that to your kid, knowing yeah. that they didn't do that's that. That's what I mean. That's just that's horrible. That is that. It's like a special mind. place in hell for you, right, dude. You know right. what I mean? I mean, that's just, that's oh, horrible. He already murdered his wife with a dog leash. He's not actually, he's, he's, not, a, he's not thinking he's on not, the same yeah. level we are. He, yeah. he tried to appeal it. And um, it was about a year after we had moved in. And my parents were in town. Uh -huh. They all live in Utah, my whole family. So they were in town visiting. And we just got back from eating dinner with them. And we pull up and there's like um, two like unmarked police cars an actual police car and they're all standing in our yard like these guys and we're all like what is happening right and they were like hey you know we just want to know the guy that you know killed his wife in this house he's uh -huh. appealing his case can we walk through the house to see what we can see from certain places and hear what we can hear from certain areas and da 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 so that's what they did it was like the DA, the arresting DA at the time, like the new DA was like one of the arresting officers and then somebody else. Uh -oh. And they were just walking through our house and they were like in the sunroom wow. seeing what they could see through our kitchen window from certain areas. And it was it was an insane thing. I bet. Meanwhile, Aaron says, stop by about 2 a.m. You get to hear you a little bit yeah. more. Yeah. I'll introduce you to her. Yeah. Come over here too. Let's have some fun. Yeah. Come on by. <laughs> start a seance. Right. Get a Ouija board out. Yeah. You know. Like no, it, maybe, maybe you said this already. What, what year was did the murder take place? Like, so um, he well, murdered four? her in 2004. Yeah. And we so, bought the house in 2011. So it's pretty recent then. It's not like yeah. it's yeah. 30 years ago or something, 40 yeah, years ago. We bought it in 2011, and the statute of limitations on when they have to disclose that to you yeah. is four years. Really? That's it? That's, that's it. it. Wow. Glad I bought new construction again. I don't, <laughs> know, I don't know what goes on but now. I know. I, like I said, I watched, I watched this on the way out here. Yeah. Okay? And the way they pegged him, mm -hmm. you know, at the, they used the forensic at the grocery store. Oh, they like with yeah, the no. rocks. That well, no, no, no. I, okay, hold, he, hold on, he, hold on to that. Hold story. on to that. <laughs> I mean, the, 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 there's a whole thing. Okay, I've never seen him this excited. Yeah, <laughs> dude, I, I'm telling you, <laughs> they used the, the math. Would you shut up? I'm trying <laughs> to tell no, Sorry to interrupt. You. <laughs> they they used the mathematical free, uh, forensics yeah. of a person walking in. To the giant using the fixed camera, yeah, getting the exact measurements of the floor tiles, mm -hmm. creating that to create his size shoe. Okay, wow. now they got the size shoe. Now they take the measurements of the door frame, so they use that mathematics to tell him how tall he is. So we're, we're narrowing because I mean I'm sure yeah. the picture that they have of the guy is right. not like crystal clear. Yeah. It's kind of yeah, blurry. So the the face sure is kind of blurry. You know, yeah. his head is down. This, this, but, was, this was a question I had: was the, okay? You see this guy bring the car, park yeah. the car, come inside, get you know, whatever he's he bought. The whole time his head is down. His head's he's got down. Hat on. He's but, covered up. But he comes in and buys something and walks out. Right. Mm -hmm. Did anybody open the trunk of the car? Well, no, not right I away. Think it was days. Like yeah. A few days. Oh, about that. But. But the, no. but the ironic. I mean, it was winter. 
Even but so, it was like, it was March. It was March. March. It was oh, yeah. still. Yeah, but the ironic thing winter. about this is, if you're trying to be inconspicuous, now that he, he this, ain't working it. This, no, no. This is what stuck out in my head. The picture, and I mean, you go on the forensic thing. It's uh, it's on the tube of you yeah. here, our peacock or whatever the hell. Watch it anyway. It's anyway, it's anyway. It's anyway. It's <laughs> he walks in, yeah. dark blue sweat jacket on. Yeah. You know, like Carhartt thing. Blah 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 blah. Guy's wearing red gloves. Oh, there you go. I mean, what is he, Mickey Mouse? You know, Ronald the Clown, <laughs> McDonald the Clown? Hey, Mickey. Okay. Mickey Mouse <laughs> has white gloves, by the way. Huh? Mickey Mouse has white gloves. White gloves. Sorry, okay. All right. That is true. All right. Anyway. Got to get facts But up. he wears the white, do you, he wears the gloves, Donald, okay? Donald? I don't know. Well, he's got red hair, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. I mean, it, but then, the worst thing of it all, when they actually, after, like she said, he starts putting it on the the oldest son right which the cops already knew there was a red herring here because they knew the relationship that the wife had because the wife was thinking about leaving him she was thinking about leaving and see there's another one anyway and that's why that that's part. why he started writing the stalker letter right. thinking it would scare her back to him. and the son actually said she wouldn't just leave and not tell us mm-hmm. you know if she was right planning on booking town yeah, she's gonna leave she's gonna leave kids right know. right yeah so they find the receipt time stamped, and this was the giant. Okay, what I had Fairview Township, whatever yeah. that was. Oh. See, I told you I watched it. Yeah. I, got you. <laughs> you I got nothing to do. Than I do. I got, I got nothing to do in the middle of the night. I've, I got, seen, I've seen this episode like five hundred times, and he right. knows it better. Than <laughs> <laughs> it's your story, but anyway, <laughs> it's your story. But let yeah. me tell it. <laughs> Finds the receipt, you know, time stamped. That he bought a box dog tree, dog mm-hmm. biscuits, yep. and he walks home. He they then a couple days fast forward, a couple days whatever. There's the jacket that he wore. It's at his workplace, and in the jacket is the gloves and the receipt. <laughs> Dead bang done. They they brought that right back. They around. fold they they peppermint patty that right back around. <laughs> they brought it right back around. But to prove back. where where she had been killed, like oh yeah 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 yeah. Go so, ahead. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can tell this. Part. <laughs> I've never seen him like this. He's so, so excited. Happened, evidently, he killed her. Well, she, what she wasn't wearing pants. Evidently, so he had put pants on her, but he put them on backwards. Oh, there you go. There's a bright mm-hmm. dude. Right, and as he's dragging her, he's dragging her, and the pants are getting like. You know, the rocks and stuff embedded right. into them. And so what from they, the driveway. Yeah. So what they did wow. is is they couldn't get like, yeah, this is a clear like from this driveway, like da da da. So they sent that out to do more forensics. Uh-huh. And that was insane. And the guy was like just like separating the dirt from like everything. Because from, because there was like like metals and stuff mixed in. Wow. And her son w- worked on cars in the garage. Uh-huh. So there was like metals and that's how they caught him. Wow. The Cause reason. they could tie it. I mean, you know, right. The- Cause what they did was they were <clears throat> testing around. Sorry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they, were, they were testing around <laughs> the grounds yeah. where she was discovered. Being i.e. the giant parking lot. The giant, right. Okay. The, the house, so that like yielded other nothing. Places around the neighborhood. That yielded nothing. But when the second dirt guy, did the forensics on the dirt? Yeah. He came up with this metal part, metal shavings, rust, iron, right? Things that would that, all come from that, working like on working a on a car. car. Then they yeah. got the uh, bright eyed, the light bulb went off. Take a sample of the driveway gravel, mm-hmm. and there match was that. dead bang number two. Right. Yeah. I mean, it's it's amazing yeah. the stuff they can match. You know, it, like, like you don't what, think about yeah. dirt, but you can match like dirt from my yard. Would be all its its own Absolutely. kind of dirt type of like, thing. It's like the whole shoemakers' like, science dirt. that goes into this like blows <laughs> my dirt. mind. <laughs> yeah, like it blows I'll my mind. Dirt. The things that they can <laughs> do. It is amazing. I, I agree with you. I I, th- <laughs> I find that stuff fascinating. Yeah, but what I find more fascinating is when you're sitting in your house and you hear a lady screaming, out, and nobody out. else hears the lady screaming. No, go, I know. Going back to that, isn't that weird? Was it like a scream, like it was like uh, like a blood curdling it- scream. But you heard it like you that. Heard That's it how you clear, heard it. Like somebody was in the next like room. It sounded like it was either on the TV uh-huh. or someone who was outside screaming. That's and what it And you just like. sat there and continued to watch your TV. What, I would have ran and got my shotgun. Listen. But yeah, but I was like, I'd get my shotgun and I'd be sitting in the corner. 
Go ahead, scream again. <laughs> uh, I, I, I don't mean, know. I can't do anything. What am I going to do? So, yeah, I agree I, with you. Like I, in that moment, I don't believe I'm like, that they can hurt us. I don't believe ghosts can hurt us. Did you ever watch Poltergeist? I have. Have you not watched any of these movies? <laughs> yeah. I've watched them. They all show that you get hurt. <laughs> hey, uh, I've watched. I've watched. Can't the, do you any I've good watched, either. I've watched the Frighteners. I've watched Poltergeist. I did watch Frighteners. That's a good movie. That is a good movie. I enjoyed that. I never heard that. I want oh, Michael J. Fox and some other girl. Yeah. Now, yeah. Arlie Ermey's in it. I like it's, Arlie. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's a, a good, it's a good show. Yeah. It's a good movie. I thought I, it was really. I good mean, movie. I haven't watched it since I was like thirteen, but yeah. Uh, John <clears throat> Aston's in it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. It, yeah. He's the he's the uh, the old gunslinger, the yeah. dead one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, like I, I just I personally don't believe that they can hurt us. I'm with you. I don't. I mean, I don't. Because I mean, I'm not gonna worry could, about it one way or the like, other. But there, there's so many dead people that are so bad. If they could hurt us, why aren't they? That's a good question. Hey, truckers, ever find yourself miles from home and running low on your daily meds? Don't worry, we've got your back. Meet Refill Genie, the telehealth service designed just for folks like us who are always on the move. Whether you're crossing state lines or hauling coast to coast, Refill Genie connects you with a licensed doctor to refill your existing prescriptions hassle-free. No more detours or long waits at the clinic. Just hop online and get your meds and keep on trucking. Use code HLL for a 15% off your order. So head over to refillgenie.com and keep your health in gear wherever the road takes you. Mike? I never Andrews. thought much past like the movie. I, I don't, I never believed in it. Cause again, I'm more like your husband. I'll believe it when I see it. And I have, I have. Just Dude, he's living in the house. I, he's I, living in the house. Well, no, I, believe, I didn't know that part. He didn't, he didn't want to see it. That's why. But he just yeah, didn't want I to. get, yeah, I get, I get that where you can, all right, I blocked this. Shit. What the hell was that? I don't know. Didn't see it. Didn't happen. You know, la, 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 but, la. I, I, nothing's ever happened to me, but I've heard enough stories from people. It's like, I don't know. Something's out there. I know we don't like understand everything in the right. universe. So there's gotta be something out there. But yeah, again, yeah. it's nothing like that has yeah. happened to me. I've strange. I but know. It's, you, you, you know what happens when you say that <laughs> strange shit happens. Stuff goes home with you. Yeah. Well, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. New house or not. It's oh, going to settle. I, my daughter, my youngest, too. <laughs> this one, I don't know if this is related in any way, but my youngest, when yeah. she was like one, like she was still in a crib. Um, <laughs> but she was like, maybe, it always is like two o'clock in the morning. So yeah, I'm wondering, well, like, if sense. maybe this was when Last she, call. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if maybe Those this back was from the, the time she was murdered. You Stop know what I mean? Bubbles. Because it's always like two. But she woke up at like two o'clock in the morning. Yeah. Like freaking out, freaking out. Like I'd never seen her like that. She was always very chill, calm, like uh, very rarely cried. And she was screaming bloody murder. Oh. And I was like, I picked her up out of her crib to try, you know, hey, calm down. Yeah. And she was just like squirming and freaking out. And so I put her down and she just started running like she was possessed, like running around, wow. like running into walls, smack, smack. A little like, Carol Ann. How about it? <gasps> and so I picked her up again because I'm like, oh, I don't need you like yeah. giving yourself a concussion because she would just boom right into the wall. Wow. And I put her back in her crib and she was sitting there crying, just sitting there looking at me. And I was on the phone with my mom because I'm like, Mom, I don't know what to do. <laughs> like, uh. And all of a sudden she stands up and just like, ah! and then sits down. And that was it. Wow. She went back to bed. Everything was fine. That's weird. That's really crazy weird. That's like. <laughs> you would have been out of there. Yes. Like, <laughs> I, did, I was on the phone with my mom. I'm like, mom, I think she's possessed. And because mm. I did. That's what it felt like to right. me. Like the way right. she was acting. And I was like, this is this. And my mom was like, listen, my family's very religious. She's like, God doesn't won't let allow you know a child to be possessed da, 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 don't worry like all this stuff she didn't, she didn't watch any movies did she <laughs> no my family does not watch uh, R-rated movies oh was Poltergeist R? Uh, back then it was probably R-rated. R-rated. Was it? Yeah. 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 It was nowadays R-rated. I don't think it would get an R-rating yeah. but back then it would then, <laughs> it doesn't even move the needle now <laughs> I, wasn't, I wasn't allowed to watch PG-13 movies until I was like 17 I guess you never saw the classic Porky's then. <laughs> no, I, I, listen, just because I wasn't allowed to do something <laughs> right. doesn't mean that I didn't do it. 
I feel you. <laughs> but yeah, no, because I wasn't either. That whole thing freaked me out. That one was right. probably like one of my scariest. That was moments. your youngest one. My youngest, yeah. Wow. And we, I'll tell like to that this day, really like weird. we talk about it, uh-huh. and I tell her the story, and she thinks it's hilarious now. But yeah. Oh my God. So she has no recollection of it. No, she has no. Well, she's only she's one, one, so she probably wouldn't. Well, you never. Yeah, I'm, dude. Like I said, <laughs> I'm. A, I was on. I was on the boat with Mike, and after watching this and this and her, <laughs> I'm on my own little island at this point. <laughs> okay. I, I think what Chipper's asking is, there's no relapses with her. Like she hasn't no, had yeah, any no, weird well, relapses what I said. or anything. Yeah, Can they no. say that? No, you no. said. Did you remember? Did she Did remember? She, oh. her? Like, right. no, she's one. I don't remember anything from, I, I was five. I don't remember crap. No, but not no, that I have a good memory. Remember, so. But she does love hearing that story. I about bet she herself. does. Yeah. Because <laughs> uh, you know, she's a kid. Yeah. You know, kids think that stuff's kind of like cool, yeah. cool. As long as she doesn't have any relapses, you're safe. Yeah. No, you know what she's, I'm saying? Like, she's ever since then, <laughs> nothing like that has happened again. The only thing I, I, I just don't get a Ouija board around her. <laughs> the, well, <laughs> you so know what I mean? Watched, like, she's sitting the there movie, all by herself watching the, the we planchette watched, movie. Uh, the movie Ouija for the first time. <laughs> They love scary like, movies like I do. <laughs> so we'll sit down and we watch these scary movies and, and we watch Ouija and they're like, we need a Ouija board. I'm like, though. We no, we don't. <laughs> I'm like, I no. I feel that. Yep. Nope. No, nope, we like, don't need no. one. No. <laughs> That's not. Nope. Yeah, just because I don't believe in this stuff, I'm not going out and tending. <laughs> right. Doesn't mean I'm going to play around with it. <laughs> My my middle daughter Stay was like, in your what, lane. If, <laughs> says, what if I get it and just and, and keep it at my dad's? And I was like, do it. <laughs> you do you boo but keep like, it there that's, that's said, the house you I said, go that's what I said if you're gonna do it anywhere that's where you wanna do it yeah and now <laughs> I mean, that's just so but weird but I told her I was like you will never have a Ouija board in my house I heard that nope no way cause while well, I get that it's a game but it's also not Oops, sorry. I'm, I keep like tapping him with my oh, foot. Move over. <laughs> she needs room. She's, she's got got to have the swing. No, no, it's fine. I, I, just, yeah. <laughs> I, I find it so ironic that people always say, "Well, it's just a game," but, but no. all kinds of weird crap happens with with just a game. Just it's a like game. no. Yeah. Mm-mm. I, I, I played Uno before. Right. Nothing weird ever happened. <laughs> you know, nothing is moving the cards around. Right. Nothing is taking my drink. Right. You know, so we're good. Nothing's talking back. I, I don't me. have to say goodbye when right. I'm done. Right. You know? Yeah, no, thank you. Nope. I'm with you. I do. I, I am a big believer in that stuff, though. Like, I do. I, I think, I, yeah. It's, I mean, something's happening. Yep. No matter what. And this, and this is where, like, my brain always goes to this point. You may not believe in Bigfoot. You may not believe in paranormal. You may not believe in Dogman. You may not believe in aliens. But people are seeing something. Mm-hmm. And until you give me a better answer for what, be, and I mean no disrespect, it's just it's like this is, my, this is where I come at it from. It's probably why Tony does the show he does. But you know, <laughs> I, I look at it like people are seeing something. Yeah. I don't know what it is. I'm, I'm not saying that's what it is. No, I hear you absolutely. But. Something is happening. There's something that's going on. Yeah, people are seeing something. Yeah, I, I, and I don't have an explanation for it. And until we do, Listen, I believe in anything. All I can do is take so. somebody's what what somebody says at face value. Yeah. Until they've shown until me that they're a liar or or until that we know what it, it is. Wrong, yeah. yeah. I mean, I, 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 I always want to give people the benefit of the doubt. Absolutely. That's just how I am. I, I'm one of you those know? people too. I will give you the benefit of the doubt until you. I don't know what I necessarily wrong. believe in or not when it comes to these things, but I, I don't. I don't like you know. Because I think people see something. Yeah. You know, people see Bigfoot mm-hmm. or not, but they see something. They see there's you know what something. I mean? there's and I hope that makes sense. I mean, I don't because yeah. I, 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 I mean, people, everybody's in, has their opinion. It's, it's just my opinion. Yeah. Uh, and what am I? I'm a stupid, You're nicer goofy, than me. Usually I just say I roll my eyes. You're freaking nuts. <laughs> I'm just a goofy truck driver. So, but yeah, you know. I don't know. I, I know. Yeah, exactly, I, I right. believe in aliens, but I, where I go, where I go off the path, they're, they're not here. They never were here. I believe we're not the only living things anywhere in the universe. I just don't see the government can't keep anything secret. So to think that there's an area of 51 in Roswell that everyone's shh, nobody, <laughs> nobody knows. And all the crap people see flying around, I think is military stuff. Cause that F F one seventeen stealth bomber, uh-huh. they were testing that thing for years. Right. And then when it finally came out, that's, that's what I saw. Well, right. you know, so I think a lot of that, but again, yeah. I'll believe it when I see it. And, and, I, I, and I totally appreciate that. There's too. stuff out there that I don't understand. <laughs> I have no explanation for it. Exactly. You know, but like, then you slowly as technology gets better, you know, like the, the UFO things in the sixties, 
Oh, everyone's seen a freaking UFO. Now everybody yeah. has a freaking camera in their pocket. Yep. I don't see no UFO hey. pictures no more. Or at least no none credible. Right. And then the Bigfoot thing, you know, the guy who just before he passed away tells everyone that it knows it fake. Hoax. Yeah. <laughs> right. Like, they, so, you know, I really like the Loch Ness Monster. <laughs> yeah. And then that, that guy walking cool. that, that Bigfoot picture, that famous thing where he's right, walking, right, looking right. back at the camera. That was a, they turned out that was a hoax. I'm like, all right, now I'm having trouble believing anything. Yeah, so right. Like that, that stuff I don't believe, like right. Bigfoot and, you know, yetis and like you know no don't tell um, tony tony don't listen nope, exactly <laughs> <laughs> and it's okay because this is but my like, show <laughs> but like ghosts and like aliens absolutely i you know i like i said i don't know what i necessarily believe in i right at, at this point i think anything is possible mm-hmm. absolutely. you know and that's why it's like it's kind of how i look at it like whatever you know i mean every time i stopped to, to go pee on the side of the road <laughs> i'm always looking for bigfoot i'm like just don't get me. You yeah. know? I want to see you, but hey, listen, if I, you're there, I like to go you know out on hikes. I'll be looking for Bigfoot. Yeah. You know I mean, I, you know, I don't. If I see him, I'm cool. open minded. That's right. You know, if I see him, cool, but I'm not like, going, that's a don't Bigfoot. be so open minded. Your brain falls out. <laughs> If I, if I see Bigfoot, though, is a Bigfoot. <laughs> the first phone call I'm making is to you. I want to get in touch with Tony. Yeah, exactly. But, uh, I, I don't. I, I just like I said. I grew up oh, in the yeah, woods. Yeah. I grew up in the good. woods. Yeah. We used to go all over. I and I never. That the. I mean, you hear from the forest all the time when you're walking. I mean, there's crack. Yeah, trees like fall a, all the time. Yeah, it's like you're hearing all kinds of stuff. But <laughs> yeah. I've never seen up on eighty. I think we have mentioned this on one of the other. Up on eighty, going across eighty, one of the hotels and one of the exits has a Bigfoot. Like it's a <laughs> cutout up on eight, like a, right in front of the motel. I guess it's a big tourism thing up there. Right. And that one time there was no power on anywhere. And that thing scared the crap out of me for just a split second. Cause there was <laughs> nothing. Right. I was like, that looks like something like, and then I, yeah, I was like, Oh yeah, that's the hotel where the Bigfoot is like against the tree. Right. But it's like, I just, I need to, see, I would love to see something. Would I would love to, I, know, right? that, I would love to believe in, in, in anything, but it's like, even the religion part, I, I need to see it to believe it. Right. I would love to believe in something. You know, but I just haven't seen anything well, that I've, makes me think, oh, that's just not, that's a little weird. And then I just go on with my day. And, you that's, know? Our, and that's okay. Like some of the stories well, that I hear. Not everybody needs to believe. Right. Yeah, it's like some of the stories. One, I think. I mean, I, I think, think it, Shipper believes for you. Yeah. yeah I, he got really excited. <laughs> He's really excited about no, it. No, no, no. <laughs> this this I got it, me. I think you made Shipper a believer. I'm just teasing with his shit. That's funny. I think it's awesome. I'm glad you're excited. Well, it's see, interesting. I'll tell you all when we're done, you know, what happened with me. And I'm like, you know, I'll, just, yeah. I'll tell you after. Share the show. No, 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 no. I, uh, I'm not oh, putting this out. I don't give a shit. All right. Oh. I'll give you that. Tease. Let you go. He's a CT. Yeah, well. <laughs> Cock tease. <laughs> <laughs> See? Right away you got right away you gotta you <laughs> brought him <laughs> in. Okay. I just said the word tease. He took it. God, he, he takes it to a whole other level. She, 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 Watching her language, and we got guy. Guy. I spent a lot of time alone in the truck. I have no well, one to talk so to but myself. I. Yeah, right. I'll give you it. Yeah. Occasionally, we'll I get slide. a phone call and I get happy. <laughs> I, I spend way too much time around weird truck drivers. Thank you very much. You do. <laughs> and I feel, but for I you. love it. I do. I, I do feel for you, especially the creepy, but uh, older ones, you know, <laughs> that stop by every night for a couple of, you know. Shut up. In and out. <laughs> you know, just like, he, he treats it like in and out burger. You know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, there's some nice. She doesn't even catch a glimpse of me. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're especially. All she hears is, I got to go. And I'm out. <laughs> yeah, no, there are nights that it's like, hey, hi, bye. Yeah, he, he gets cranky. <laughs> That's all right. I get cranky, too. Yeah, I don't ever get cranky. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah. No? Does. No. Well, let me record one of those phone calls. <laughs> I know. What phone calls? Yeah. <laughs> what phone calls? I don't get cranky. I just kind of, that's my natural state. I just, I don't, it, it is I'm a natural always state. pissed He's off about that something. Whatever yeah. state. <laughs> well, but, yeah, I, I've, I've got to go back to what, what, what still blows my mind is that your husband still lives in that house. Well, he doesn't believe anything's going on. So. But has, have your daughters ever talked to their stepmom? Or, you know, I don't know how you refer to her, but her step, their stepmom. Like, has she ever said anything to her? They talked to her. Has she ever said anything? I'm not trying to get close oh, to you, sorry. but I don't want to just hit you in the head. Uh, no. I'm just curious. No. You know, just, I don't. 
I'm, I just really wonder if, if like it was because you're a female, it was communicating with you. Well, what do you think? The stepmom's a female. That's why I asked. She, she's a female. But <laughs> I would. Well, no, I don't. I don't, want to, don't want to assume anything. I don't think my kids are close <laughs> enough to talk to her about. That. Okay, that's because I mean she might just be you know uh, afraid to herself. You know what I mean? Like yeah. she's living in fear by herself. Because yeah, she knows well, that, that your ex doesn't believe in any of this yeah, stuff. And, and she's and got it, nobody else to talk to about it. This would blow my mind if she actually she actually experienced that's what I mean. the same I, thing. I, exactly. And she doesn't say nothing to anybody. Right. That that's why Well, she doesn't say know. anything to anybody. And, and honestly, I've never I've never asked her. Me and her don't particularly get along. And so. I totally understand. <laughs> well, that's why that's the whole <laughs> thing between totally us. Right. So I mean I feel weird saying this because I know <laughs> that my ex could possibly hear this, but I don't care. Do you think he listens to our show? <laughs> All right, another he knows, subscriber. He, he, knows, well, he, knows, he knows one of our drivers very, very well. Oh. So. That's crazy. It's not me. Trust me. No, it's it's not true. It probably wasn't you. <laughs> it's, he was a line haul driver. He's now a city driver. Oh, okay. Again, though. But yeah, no, we were all next door neighbors. Uh-huh. Like, so. Mm. Wow. But, yeah. But no, it's just it's just one of those things that you, know, you just kind of think about. If it happened to you, is it happening to her? You know, and I and I get I get the. Honestly, I hope it is. And well, <laughs> like you said, the house is in foreclosure when you bought when it. When we what, bought it, what, did the people why did they say why the people before left? Um, was it like just, and I'm out? You right, know, that could be, right, right. Away. That's I was curious. That's a good question, Mike. Um, all we knew is that they were behind on payments. Mm. It makes mm. you wonder if they left. And they just said the hell with it. Yeah. 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 I don't know. You know, it's kind of color. got thrown there in my head. A, I'm out. Yeah. Would, yeah I, 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 I got one other question. Okay. <clears throat> and I'm going to, fi- I will find this out. You said between two and three. Yeah. You'd hear this. Yeah. I'm going to, f- I got to go research this. Damn I'm sure there's a time of estimated time. Well, that's of, what I'm thinking is like she estimated was time of death. Time. When you know she, what her name was? Uh-huh. Yeah. Everybody pull out the phone. Just Google now. it. Google. Let's just Google it. Yeah, but then you might, you'll probably well, find like an obituary or something. Oh, I, I mean, I don't it's, want to put her name out on the, you know. But you, if you just type it in, just type in her name and, and time of death. Okay. Or whatever, Stand or, by, people. We're allowed to use our phones. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. All of a sudden, shippers. Hey, you okay. gave me the well, okay. You put me on the spot. Now I'm drawing a blank on the last name. Oh, I didn't mean to do uh, that. I, I, I yeah. Hell, hell, hell. Oh yeah! Mm. Hold helmet. You know, I'm gonna pull my phone too, guys. I want to see this for. I want to see this forensics file. Do you know what it, the it name is on YouTube? Yeah, exactly. uh, I looked it up. Yes, <clears throat> I, I did watch it. What it is is Char- well, her first name is Charlene. Yeah, yeah, the, the, yeah. I just had it here. Almost like Jolene. No, Jolene, <laughs> Jolene. <laughs> but Charlene, showing your age. It's uh, episode eleven. <laughs> I mean, season eleven, episode thirty one, thirty. 30, 30, it says on my Google. 30, okay. And that's it's forensic files, right? Yep. Yeah. Yep. This is this is how you do good. You know video. where that's streaming at? Like H- what? Hummer. 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 You know Charlene what? Hummer. Oh, we weren't going to say her name. Oh, that's all right. That's not going to matter. Cut that, cut that part out. Yeah. They can cut it out if they want to. Where the hell was it? I just watched it. Why wouldn't it be right here? Uh, I guess if it's been on the new, if it's been on uh, forensic files and her name was put out there, yeah. I guess it's okay. For is it stream? To... What's it streaming on? Like it's on YouTube. YouTube. You it, it's on YouTube. Yeah. It's on YouTube. But if you just you type or... in forensic files, <laughs> the episode. All the stuff about him. He looks like a piece of work, right? <laughs> yeah. And hey, you want to know his name? Brian. 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 Oh. Really? <laughs> yeah. Brian. Oh my God. That's a that popular sense. name. How old was he? Fifty-four. Yeah. Is that the is that the woman? Is that that's her? Yeah. Oh, that's a shame. Yeah, she's very. She pretty. worked for Penda. Yeah. Oh, she worked for State of Pennsylvania. State of Pennsylvania. Yeah. yeah. Well, Humbert. Humbert. Yeah. Humbert. That's. A, never heard that last name before. Humbert. Nope. Engelbert Humperdinck. Yeah, I'm sort of. Humber- yeah, I don't. Dink, I don't know if I've ever seen part. an actual like dink. time of like <laughs> or like. Ish death for her, but yeah, I'll go. S- How old was she when 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 he did her in? Well, he was fifty four. You know? He was in his fifties. So she might be in her fifties. Uh, yeah, early fifties. 
That's just such a shame. I mean, I hate to hear that kind of stuff. I just do. It's just, it's disturbing. I guess it should be. It is yeah, murder really yeah. aren't soothing usually. Yeah, it's not. She was 48. 48. Wow. Yeah. I'm sorry to said that she right. looked like she's in her 50s. <laughs> Women don't like to hear that. <laughs> Please don't haunt me. She was right? close to 50. <laughs> she was like, yeah, 40, 48, 48 is close. I mean, it's it's with the net that ring there. Yeah, it aired, it aired February 7th, 2007. Uh, yeah, wait. like in the episode, like the house they show. Yeah. That's the actual house. Is, and like in the kitchen, there was an orange like light hanging from like the island, and that was there when we moved in. Wow! We, I took that out. I was like, "That's gone." Yep, I heard that. But yeah, that orange light that they have in the video when they show like the view of the kitchen. Yeah, everything on the inside is all like a dramatization. That, but the outside pictures are all like the house. Did he just not like her? Like, did he have a reason? I think well, he just was you know jealous I mean? that yeah. she wanted to leave and he wanted to keep her oh, around. I mean, you ever hear that old, there's a many fish in the sea thing. Yeah. Did I have to, well, there's a lot of just, trash in the sea see with him? those fish. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You throw garbage <laughs> in the ocean. I don't know. There's, there's a lot of trash with all have that. Fish. Him? He, he looks uh, creepy. Yeah, he, he Looks like the hills have eyes. Thank God I right. got my hair. <laughs> Take your hat off. No offense. <laughs> Take your hat off. Yeah. Keep that to yourself. <laughs> hey, listen, that doesn't offend me. We used to hang dog leashes at Halloween in the trees. Oh, boy. Oh. <laughs> Get you guys going. <laughs> <laughs> we figured we might as well have a might little. Might as well play with it, right? Well, I figured Is that the tree that got uprooted? No, no, it was our front yard trees. <laughs> now, did, you but, ever, did you ever experience any, uh, mm-hmm. like, you know, Somebody sitting on the bed or any, anything where you ever felt anything? Mm, never where I felt like I was like being touched or like right. somebody was like sitting next to me. <coughs> it was more just like things happening. Gotcha. Well, I tell you what, if I threw a toy in the yard and it wound up back in the <laughs> back house. Back in the house. That, that's enough for me. <laughs> it was a caterpillar. It's a caterpillar. <laughs> Took a while. <laughs> it was curl back in the house. <laughs> Yeah, it just inches way back in. Yeah, he's worm. <laughs> Mr. Worm. Powder over here. All of a sudden, he's oh, the caterpillar's crawling in. Yeah, it's a toy. It was motorized. It came back in on its own. That, that's that's and the it's, reason. It's crazy. Okay. I Is mean, it, that wasn't the only toy that did it, but that was the only one that you I... You had multiple toys get possessed and do strange Yeah, I crap? mean, like toys... No, they that, weren't possessed. Like, you know, the little... Being used. The little mats that when they're little and that you're trying to gain their motor function so they lay, lay right. under them and they can hit the them. The mobiles and, and that kind of stuff. Oh, yeah. Mobile, yeah, yeah, like that would go off when yeah. they were all asleep. Wow. I'm taking the batteries out of everything. Right. <laughs> you don't know you how know, lucky I you are not to have She did that and it yeah. still done it. <laughs> I, was, I did do that and it still did it. Wow. Shit, man. I didn't have any kids. Yeah, that's, that's what, when when that did it, I was like, because the batteries in the little caterpillar just, they died and then you threw the toy away. Right. But with the little But it mobile, kept coming back. <laughs> <laughs> but with the mobile thing, I did. I took the batteries out and yeah. it still, and that's when I was like, this is. Yeah, that's weird. Jesus. That is really weird. Yeah. But my, I mean, my oldest daughter used to talk to my brother-in-law. He passed away when she was like three I think, and I would wow. hear her on the baby monitor talking to him. His name was Brant, and she called him Brat because she couldn't say Brant. So she would say on the monitor all the time, like, oh, da da, Brat, Brat. Like she would just talk and, like, wow. she was playing with my brother in law. That's the weird stuff. That's the stuff that you look at and you're like, I got no explanation nope. for that. I don't right. know. I, is that, is, uh, I don't but know. you do yeah. hear that every once in a yeah. while with yeah. the kids. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, That's they say I, kids I, are very honestly, t- intuitive to that because they don't have like eyes shielded like adults do. Right. Yeah. They, they're not jaded yet. Yeah. Yeah. You know, uh, uh, but you know, just YouTube baby monitor stuff. Mm-hmm. Holy crap. You're like, I would never have a baby monitor. Especially when you could see. What do you mean like, you don't have a baby monitor? You got Alexa. Had, had it not been I don't my, have Alexa. <laughs> had it not been my brother in law, I might have had like a harder time, but I was like, Oh, that's kinda cute. <laughs> and, yeah, right? At least somebody <laughs> hopefully somebody you know. I trusted and knew, right. you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. um, but yeah. and like the crazy thing is is he had died before she even really knew who he was. Like right. he had died and she was two. And and, and he, we lived in Utah. He lived in Texas. Wow! Yeah, it's not like they had even like known each other really. Yeah, it's not like she saw him on a regular basis. Yeah, and got, you know. And so, 
just to hear her saying his name, I was like, how does she know that? Right. <laughs> that is really weird. Yeah, that's crazy. Like, but yeah, like. And this was when you were in. This is when we lived. Well, this was not in that house. Oh, okay. This was in the house we lived in before we bought the house, the house we were renting. But yeah, like I just, I feel like ghosts are everywhere. I yes. could be right there next, right next to you to right now. How you doing? Right behind him. I, right. Hey, I used to be like scared of that crap. Playing with his yeah. ears and shit. Yeah. You know? Going back to Disney World, that haunted mansion where the, the hologram <laughs> is sitting in the car with you as you're going around. <laughs> My mom said I freaked out, so I tried to get out on the ride to try to get out of that That's car. Wow. I was so freaked out. <laughs> That's funny. Scarred him for life. I not did. Believe I don't in anything. believe in nothing. Disney lied to me. That's not a real ghost. <laughs> it wasn't even a real ghost. <laughs> it wasn't. It's Shazam. <laughs> it's lying. That is, it, what, that's uh, it. what else happened? Yeah, I think that's about it. That's really like. Yeah, what else you need? I was going to say. That'd be enough, man. Apples showing up in the Apples, yard. Apples, toys going Toys on, moving around. Things flying across the room. Pictures falling. I'm good. Kids may be possessed. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that would be the one for me. That, that is the one. I, that's the one. It's like, what the heck's going on? It, that one was yeah the most scared I had ever been for yeah. sure. That and it, 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 it was a good 30, 45 minutes of her just ah, like wow. freaking out. And that's wow. your oldest one? My youngest. Oh, the youngest. Yeah. Well, the is, one who is, even to this day, the yeah. most cool, calm, collected, <laughs> easygoing. Got it all out of her system. Like, Oh yeah, all Early, that forty-five yep. minutes. That yep. was it. That was it. <laughs> She's like, like we're getting this shit on early. Yep. <laughs> what, what, what could that have been? Like, did she see something, or was like? I don't know if maybe. As I, I, yeah, I don't know if maybe she just had a bad dream. Like, if she was possessed, like or, I don't know. Or she felt like something woke her up. Woke her up. Scared, scared her, her. Woke her up. Yeah, and, I don't uh, know. she didn't know how to respond. But to then it, it, that stopped, it stopped that fast. Or she, she screamed real quick, and then it was over. It's like. Yeah, I, I, well, I, I mean, I know, it right? was like 45 minutes of the screaming before I put her in the crib and she right. was like, bah, and then that, then it was over. <laughs> that, that whole like, that last whole last thing, that last gasp. Whatever that was, I, yeah, that I did, weird. I jumped back. I was yeah. like, oh, I like mean, it scared me. <laughs> I've had, I, we, well, we went on vacation up to Potter County. This, this is true. I'm, this, I am not kidding you. I, we're, we're sitting outside. I had my daughter, or I think she was, I think Alex was with us then. Yeah. Yeah. Alex was there. I remember you said that. Tony and Lindsay, Ben, Gemma, Jackson, Michelle, and myself. And yeah, so that's like, I don't know, seven or eight, nine, whatever mm -hmm. people. We're all sitting outside, just shooting the breeze. It's like 11 o'clock at night. And I'm not kidding you. There was nobody around me. And I heard my name whispered in my ear. It, it <laughs> freaked me out. I bet. I, I, don't I didn't know up. what to say, and, and and I know it sounds weird. I know the it. Hills I know can talk. But I, I'm that? looking, and there's nobody around me. The little kids are over playing in, in the you know the grass, and it freaked me out. I sat there for a few minutes, and I'm like, and I I, I looked at, at 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 Tony. I'm like, did you hear anything? And he's like, no. I said, did anybody else hear anything? Anybody call my name? Yeah. And nobody. they're like, nope. And then Tanya goes, I heard that in the house when I went up the steps. Something called my name. Somebody said my name in my ear. Back it up, we're leaving. I know. I was like, I'm renting this place for twenty five hundred bucks. I ain't leaving. I'm getting my money out of this. Holiday in down the so, street. <laughs> yeah. So, so, I, right I mean, down to the hotel you know, there in Pot at Data City. <laughs> it, it, I know right where you are. Scared the poop out of me. I, I mean, it really scared me. Yeah. Like, and and that, the rest of the week I was like really, you know, at night. I was very tense. I'm sure you, know? you were. That would have freaked me out. Too. Uh, yeah, I was. It, it just made me like really on edge. Mm -hmm. And uh, but I enjoyed myself. You know, I just I was just you know, you're listening. You're and I know like you don't know what to make yeah. of it. You're like, is was it in my head? Yeah. Did I just hear it? Yeah. Was you know? I just hearing? Was it just you know? Like you try to talk yourself nowhere? out of all the possibilities. Yeah. 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 And you, but then when your daughter says something to you, and you're like, I mean, that was the week that they got engaged. Yeah. So. When it, like when it happens to more ago. than one person on the same weekend, yeah, at the same <laughs> yes. place, yeah, yeah, it's not you're you're just drunk, right. yeah, <laughs> and, and that's why it's you know, you know that that that's that's just one of 
yeah. one, of, one of the goofy experiences that I've had. And it's like, it's just weird. It, it makes you think. It makes you wonder. You, you know, when it happens to you, you're not looking. You're looking for every excuse for That's it not to be. For Yeah. You know, because you're like, I don't want to believe you, this. I got to sleep here for the rest what, of the what week. What it just was. You're trying to explain yeah. yourself what it just was. Yeah. But you Rationalize can't. it. There's nothing. Yeah. Because I, I still, to this day, I cannot think what it was. Yeah. I have no clue. No oh, clue I, at all. I completely, like those <laughs> apples on the ground, right. I cannot tell you to this day right. how those got there. Yep. Yeah. I, I, I get it. But where that tree was every freaking year on one day. I don't even know if it was the same day. I didn't pay that close attention. I just right. know that I'd come out and one day there'd be a pile of apples. There you go. I, I saw UFOs when I was a kid. Yeah. I believe and in all I, that. And I know I saw them. And you know how I know I saw them? I verified it with my older brother. He's six years older than me. I was six. He was 12. I'm like, dude, did you did we see this? He's like, yeah. We we're all at our aunt's house. These two lights come hovering over top of the hill in Nutripoli. Silent. Uh, two two lights and we're like right across the street from this hill. I mean, yeah. literally sh- street. Yeah. Hill. <laughs> you know, hill and all street, of our families were out. <laughs> well, all my aunt, my aunt. Where the lights husband, blue? <laughs> that one was blue and one was white. Yeah, hill street blues. <laughs> <laughs> and it was the weirdest thing. And I'm like in my head for the, the longest time, like I remember seeing this. Mm-hmm. And so I, 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 I was talking, Tony wanted me to, you know, to tell the story on, on the confessionals. So I said, all right, I would, you know, but I wanted to make sure, like, I wasn't just dreaming this, right? Because mm-hmm. there's like me and I have, I have five siblings and my parents and my cousin's parents. And there's like five siblings. We're all out there. We all saw it. Yeah. So I said to my brother Cameron, like, mm-hmm. did we see this? And he's like, yeah. And he explained the whole thing to me. I was like, yeah, that's, that's what I saw. What I, saw. <laughs> I, was like, I just had to make sure before I said this. You're like, yeah. I think Brian's crazy. Yeah, <laughs> you no, know, my whole family I goes, think his cheese slid off his cracker. <laughs> I think <laughs> I did. <laughs> On Netflix, they have like the UFO files. Yeah. That one, I watched that. That was crazy. Yeah. To it, have like a whole schoolyard full of, of kids. kids. Who see, see and, 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 and when they interviewed each kid, they all they told all the same the story. the same thing. Yep. Everything was the same. Yep. That's, that's why it's They like, drew yeah. pictures and they were slightly different, but that's just because kids that's, draw slightly different. Right. But they were all generally the same thing. Yep. Yep. I mean, kids, you know, their, their perception, mm-hmm. they, you know, things that they're going to remember, things that are going to yeah. poke out in their head. And that's, that's why I had to check with my brother. I'm like, yep. I just got, I mean, and this was just, I mean, I, I think I just talked to Tony about this like maybe five years ago. Yeah. So it's like, it's, it's not, you know, in fact, well. Four years because when we first started the show, I went down to his house to do the first show. He's like, "You know, I want to get this on. I want to record you on this and, and get this." I better check with my brother about that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know? Better do some research. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to sound like a just trip. a little show prep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Huh? <laughs> but yeah, you did a little just, show prep. And look at how that show took off. Why don't you do a little bit for this one? <laughs> well, yeah, you know, he, he does. Uh, he has like two hundred thousand uh, subscribers on uh, YouTube. Right. I'm like, dude. He has 200,000 subscribers? Yeah, on his YouTube channel. Yeah, it's like, nuts. I think it's 200. Yeah, That's something like that. pretty damn good. It bro. is, yeah. Anyway, I think it's really interesting. And I appreciate you coming on and talking. Yeah, and I, no I've, problem. I, I, I love talking about it. Like, to me, that those are, like, my most interesting story. Well, yeah. It, it, <laughs> like, I love talking about yeah, it, it. it. Well, it's stuff that, that goes on that... that not everybody you, has that kind of story. Right. And you don't know what to make it. Very boring. Apparently, I don't have any stories like that. You need an old house. That's what you, just, you need a house. <laughs> well, I mean, I grew up in a house. Murder my, house. My grandparents had old houses. <laughs> have, my grandparents, my great grandmother had a house that was over 100. And now it's like 140 years old. And wow. it's like, to my not, my, I know my grandparents believed into all that yeah, yeah. stuff. But I just never saw and anything. Yeah, I totally understand <laughs> that. And, and I get you that. I, I get Pennsylvania. To get this experience, <laughs> this is true. This state is scary. I will give you that. I agree. I agree. <laughs> it's Pennsylvania, but yeah, I, you know, it's interesting. I find this stuff really interesting. I think it's interesting yeah. to, to to think about, to muse, oh yeah, talk about, you know, listen to people's story. Well, and, and uh, I like like I'll watch old forensic files, other yeah. ones, and I like to just do my own little like research and like little yeah, that's um, cool rabbit hole of stuff i i'm like oh that's right. kind of cool like how do we how does that go 
Yeah, it, it's crazy, isn't it? Yeah. Just the stuff that you can, that you can see. The stuff that nowadays everything's on video. Yeah, you know uh, that's why. Like, how do they figure out how to you know like with all the blood samples that they right. had from a hundred years ago that they're now yep. just using to yeah. now they solve can use DNA and stuff. Murders. Right, like that stuff is fascinating. It is. To me. It really is. Yep. And Mike was just talking about that before we. With the, when, that Christy likes to watch those shows. Oh, the Dateline and all that stuff. Every <laughs> right, Friday yeah. night she watches and I have to sit there and watch my wife learn how to get rid of me. Well, that's because okay. you... These you, are the mistakes that person made. Yeah. I won't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> that's because you wanted the day shift job, remember? <laughs> she was happy when you were night shift. I think so. Yeah, she had her own little notebook all ready to go. <laughs> Uh, well, thank you so much, Aaron, for coming in. Yeah, this was no this problem. was a blast. I, I had fun. I, I, oh, we yeah, did too. Nice. I know we had a good we had a good time. Thank you so much. Yeah. I know it, it. You know, it's a trip to come up and all that. So and I apologize I because I sounded a little anxious. No, 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 <laughs> a little. I was, I was, I was glad you're They excited. told me I didn't participate in the show. I, I, never, I do one research I was, thing. <laughs> I was glad that you were excited about the show because I thought you know it adds to that you know that that whole uh, mystique of the show. You know, like this is a very mysterious show. Amberlane Legends, you know. But all that being said, thank like you for coming in. We hope you enjoyed yourself. We I enjoyed did. ourselves. And we hope everybody out there listening enjoyed themselves. Mike, if they enjoyed themselves, what can they do? Share the show. Share the freaking show. Share it. With everybody. How? Wh where do they share it? You can write it on the bathroom wall. You could do a, that. For a Just good podcast, you listen to. Or when you're in a shower and it's all you know, steamed up and you see the writing on the mirror. <laughs> there you go. That's there you a go. <laughs> all right. Well, all that being said, keep the hammer down. Good night. Good night. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. <laughs> <laughs>